Sets for Life is here today to salute 10 well-deserving caregivers. We're so excited because we have over 40 vendors who are going to be giving out information to the community. We have screenings, massages. We have um, the band from Citrus College. We have jumpers for the children, our play area. We're just really excited about our sixth annual event. We want to welcome you to the campus of Second Baptist Church, and we are thankful for your gathering and of course, I am anticipating the great things that you and I are going to receive today, and it will be life-changing. Of course, this is a historical day as we reflect upon 9-11, and of course, as we reflect upon that with much uh, gratitude in our hearts unto the Lord for the past and the present, and things that we are doing even now, reaching out to make a significant difference. Won't you join me in a moment of prayer? Holy Father... We are thankful for the occasion which brings us together. But now we're going to have an official welcome from our own council member, Clarence Shaw. Let's give him a hand. Hey, hey, hey. Yes. And David talks about help and how help comes from God. Mm -hmm. God will send that help. And I look at this venue as help that God has sent because these are resources that people need. They're very close to us. Many of our people in the community can't go out to get these type of resources, get this one stop. So certainly we're very appreciative for what you've done. We also have you, if you'd like to use their website for a nutrition guide, you just put in the things that you eat every day, kind of like a journal, and then they can tell you how many calories you're eating, how many fiber, you know, how much fiber, how much protein. So those things are good to know in case your doctor asks you. It's just an honor to represent this wonderful community, and I've come and shared fellowship at this congregation, and it's just a wonderful place, and the idea that we're going to help people be healthy, I need that. <laughs> So I need all the help I can get, and it's just wonderful to see a community come together to see people set for life. And I have certificates from the state of California congratulating the 10 honorees, so we're going to get that to the honorees. So congratulations for your honor and doing all you do, and this is just a wonderful community, and I'm proud to be here. It often amazes me how many people give up their time, give up themselves, when they also have their own struggles in life. Um, I'm just excited about this whole thing. Hi, I'm Valerie Burwell, uh, president of the women of Second Baptist Church, and this is Patricia, an honoree. And uh, Patricia used to uh, babysit my girls, who will be 36 tomorrow. She's been babysit. She babysat them since they were a baby. And it's just, I'm really proud of her to get this. Well deserving of it. Oh my God, I was very surprised. I was crying. <laughs> it's, it's wonderful. Thank you very much for what you've done. <laughs> I really was surprised. Cause they know I've been doing this a long time in Morovia. You were nominated. We want to thank our title sponsors, Wells Fargo, Foothill Transit, Arcadia Chiropractic, City of Hope, and Southern California Edison. We're really excited that there are partners and supporters this year. We're really excited because we have the City of Duarte and Monrovia also partnering with us. Thank you so much.